So today I'm going to do some plumbing. I'm going to install my faucet and my um, handles to turn the hot and cold water on. And then I'm going to install my sink that goes here. First thing that goes in is this faucet. So I'm going to put it through this hole and then screw it in at the bottom. All right, that went in smoothly and it's all ready. And the next one is going to be the hot water handle and then on the side, the cold water handle. All right, my faucet and my handles are installed. I just need to do some plumbing in the bottom area and I will show you when I'm done. All right, the plumbing in the bottom is done. I just need to get a connector that goes from here to here and then from here to here. So I will start on the sink now. So the sink is lightly placed in here and I'm going to use these little connectors that it um, came with to fasten it in the bottom and make it waterproof. Finally, the sink, sink is all screwed in with these little holders all the way around, two on each side. And I'm going to do this part next. All right, my strainer is installed and at the bottom it looks like this. So basically I'm going to have a pipe come from here into a gray water tank that I plan to put right here. So last night I ordered these water bottles. It says American made water bottle from Walmart. I ordered two and I'm going to use them for my gray water, which is water that comes out of the sink and under, under the sink and into here. And then whenever it gets full, you can see it. And I'm going to take it out and pour it in the grass. And so that's one for the kitchen and one for the bathroom. So I already bought my sink for my bathroom in the cabinet and I have my faucet that I bought a long time ago for it. So I'm just going to unpack the sink and cabinet and then install the faucet. So this is what the sink and the cabinet look like for the bathroom. I installed that and it has an empty space in here for the water, hot and cold water to be and to connect to the faucet, which is up here. I'll show you when I install it. All right, it is all installed. The faucet and handles and then the little thing that is in the drain that stops the water and then lets it go through. And it looks like this underneath. And I just have this here for the time being. Um, this um, water jug wouldn't fit under there. So I'm going to have to return this or use it for something else and then find something else for this for the gray water so this is the end of this video and i will see you next time bye